the Monty Python Challenge, Siri versus Cortana versus Google from the year 2015. Hi, my name is Dale Ross, and this is the Monty Python Challenge. We're going to challenge the three devices that you've seen me carry in a picture. First is the iPhone 5S running iOS 8.1.3. This is a business phone thus managed by my IT people and I will have to be persistent in keeping the screen active. It is on the Verizon network and also Wi-Fi. This is a Lumia 1020. It is running Windows Phone 8.1.1. It does not have the denim update. It is also running a beta version of Cortana. This is a Samsung Galaxy S4. It is running Android KitKat 4.4.4. What is my name? Your name you are Bruce, but since we are friends, I get to call you Bruce. Sorry, I'm covering up my contact information. Siri knows that my nickname is Bruce. Cortana has been told to call me Bruce, thus she said I'm Bruce. And Google doesn't have a personality, so it does not respond in that manner. So now let's uh, move on to the real part of the challenge. What is your quest? It's nice of you to ask. Can I help you with something? Grail. Siri, not giving up any information, telling me it was nice to ask, can she help me with anything? Google brings up a link to the scene from the Holy Grail on YouTube, and Cortana does one better in actually telling me what the quest is. That's that personality thing. That's what Jesus said, sir. Okay, all three brought up the same information, a little bit different order and formatting. The first hit for Siri is a link to the scene from Life of Brian. So is the first hit for Cortana. You can see she also adds a YouTube video. Google's first hit is a quote from WikiQuote. And then the second hit is the same YouTube video. Blessed are the cheesemakers. Okay, so uh, Siri doesn't understand. This is a quote from the life of Brian, Jesus' Sermon on the uh, Mount. Cortana and Google both bring up scenes from the movie on YouTube as their first results. She turned me into a newt. I'm not sure I understand. Again, another pretty famous quote. Siri again fails to understand. Cortana and Google both bring up links to YouTube videos of the scene. This is the scene where they are trying to determine if a young lady is a witch. What have the Romans done for us? Let me think about that. Here's some information. Siri brings up a quote from the movie. So that's pretty good. Cortana and Google actually bring up YouTube links to a scene from the life of Brian where the PFJ, the People's Front of Judea, or the People's Judean Front, these are the splitters, are discussing the oppression by the Romans. A wafer thin mint. Hi. Cortana and Google both bring up Mr. Creosote in the meaning of life just after he has eaten the way for thin mint is exploding but this is youtube links to that particular scene and siri thought she needed to say hi to that i fart in your general direction where would you like to go cancel i will not then okay siri wanted to direct me to some location fail Cortana and Google both bring up the scene from the Holy Grail where the French on the castle are taunting King Arthur and his knights. Cat detector van. I'm not sure I understand. Siri doesn't understand. Seems to be a common thing. Cortana and Google both bring up the fish license scene information. And you can see some pictures of a cat detector van apparently somebody is building. Put her in the comfy chair. I'm not sure I understand. 
Again, she doesn't understand. Cortana and Google bring up YouTube links to the Spanish Inquisition skit from the Flying Circus. I soiled my armor. I don't understand. I soiled my armor. But I could search the web for it. Okay, Cortana brought up the link from the Holy Grail. Siri again doesn't understand. Wants to do a search and Google thinks I said I sold my armor. My lazy pronunciation. I'm not sure why Google has a hard time with this. And actually that time it was ISO oil my armor. Interesting. I soiled my armor. So I sold my armor. That's strike two. I soiled my armor. And that's strike three. Do it one more time. I sold my armor. So say it different ways and it comes up all for some reason. Speech recognition, Google's not quite there. This doesn't understand me. Okay, that's it, I think, with the personality. And of course, Cortana went 10 for 10. Google did very well. And Siri doesn't know Monty Python. That's all we can say. That's it. Tell me what you think.